Mutunga miri webatu rezan PF upangwe chete ne mutevezeri wavo hava VP chuwenga mbawari zuwa pachena corruption yesa ya varu kuita inside Zimbabwe. Apo patuko na suskuti wa Jonathan Moyo. Vano wa former uh, Zimbabwean information minister mbubuti sa rezere rukitika inside Zan PF. In fact this is laughable. Seriously laughable. First of all this is an accusation coming from the most corrupt politicians and public officials in the history of our country. They cannot account for the assets that they have. Uh, the richest individual in the Republic of Zimbabwe is Emerson Mnangagwa. The one person who was responsible for setting up ZANU-PF companies when he was the Secretary for Finance of the ruling party is Emerson Mnangagwa. There is no cent that comes from those companies, including a bank. Muri ya Zimbabwe. Tukuchinga mzai kechipiri rakare pano pachano yenyu ye Paurimbo TV. Musuwa 21 June, Friday 2024. Tutenda nukuya kwa maita. Tutenda rakare nukuchuza kwa maita kechipiri. Kutumuzi nzuwe na uzi rukitika mkati maino inyika ya Zimbabwe. Kana ingari first time yako, uchangu tanga kutubata. Mkana nduwa uyo kubaya kabata. Kana ingari kakanzi subscribe. Kana ingari kachubuda pa screen. Inzira ino kubaza la kutawuzo poswe ni maapdete na uze sisa tenge chisa muna mchano yenyu ya Power Rimbo TV. Tisanga da upeza nguwa watari reka tukuzivisa ya zakari rukitika mkati maino nyika ya Zimbabwe. Akuva pakabudis kwa malidi odiozi hawa chivayo. Tirukuwa na suskuti insa design PF Polity Bureau. Zawa kuita kungezo hawa kuchi nyandurwa nyandurwa. Ani e, corruption zese za kuitika mbatole za NPF. Zawa kuita ungeza hawa kuchi pachuka. Tirukuwa nzuka pana pakuti former Zimbabwe ni information uh, minister professor Jonathan Moyo. Uh, pane uhuru kuro ya waka itawo ni television ya kunyika ya South Africa. Uko uo kwa waka zoobudi sa rezere about zuruku itika mbato za NPF wa chitiu. Uh, Bunangagwa ndiye uh, richest uh, individual in Zimbabwe. Uye zewo imbava iwombe mkati menyika ya Zimbabwe. Ndoma sana ngura waka itawo pa uhuru kuro ii ya waka kurugura nanu nziye sofi makoena anuwa uh, mtauriri wa television ya South Africa. Tukona watari rikuti wa Jonathan Moyo ndiyo zakare mungwe e, wevangu wakambu pumeru wao mwosa mne mangwe makore wa chinziwo wa pumeru wa mwosa yukunziwo wanga wa shandisa Maria Zimbabwe Government Power Development Fund a, for political e, patronage in his a, warm district e, kuna waku sholosho wakunziwo wane Maria wakambu bao zakare waka zukazukunze saa kuti wange wachizo buda mkati meno nyike Zimbabwe saka tukone suskuti Corruption ni yesa inenge chitika inside Zimbabwe. Vaa kutuwa iziva. Inenge chitika inside ZANPF. Vaa kutuwa iziva. Saka uo apapane urukuro ya waka ita. Ne televisioni ya kunyika ya South Africa. Ndiyo ya ita kuti tinga tishu ya pana mbati chuone sana watariri. Zuruku itika inside ZANPF. Zuruku nzuwe suskuti. Uh, paru kunzipo munangagwa is the richest individual in Zim through stealing corruption. Jonathan Moe says. In an interview with Sophie Makoena, Anova Mtauriri we television in yes, South Africa, former Zimbabwean information minister Professor Jonathan Moyo launched a catching allegation against the current ZANPF leader Emerson Mnangagwa, accusing him of being the richest individual in Zimbabwe through stealing. Those accusation is true, paint and distributing picture of corruption that is the highest level of Zimbabwean politics. Professor Moyo did not uh, mean word uh, in his accusation stating Munangagwa stole billions of cash through diamonds in Chiazwa. Brought the Chinese to loot resources, he set up uh, ZANPF companies to steal resources. Those claims suggest a pattern of uh, systematic corruption and exploitation of Zimbabwean's natural resources for personal gain. The backdrop of those allegations include Munangagwa's rise to power, uh, notably uh, through a controversial coup and in 2017 that outstead long-time uh, leader Robert Mugabe. Professor Jonathan Moyo implied that his coup, uh, the, this coup was an attempt by Munangagwa to, to cleanse himself and his allies of their alleged corruption. Munangagwa staged a coup to atone for corruption. Further complicating the allegation are claims that Munangagwa along with other key figures such as Constantino Guvech Wenga and S.B. Moyo were involved in looting resources during uh, Pagaitika Wondo Yegu DRC. Those accusations, if substantiated, underscore a troubling history of exploiting regional conflicts uh, for personal enrichment. 
in response to those serious allegations Mnanga Kwasa's administration uh, consistently uh, denied any wrongdoing uh, portraying such claims as a political motivated attacks by uh, detractors however those allegations from a former insider like Jonathan Moyo who was uh, once part of the ruling party uh, the, 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 the ruling party ZANPF party add significant weight to existing concerns about corruption within Zimbabwe political elite the, the the broader implication of those allegations extend beyond uh, beyond the domestic politics affecting Zimbabweans international reputation and its ability to attract foreign investment the perception of widespread corruption at the highest level of government can undermine economic stability and enroll the public trust in the institution as calls for transparency and accountability grow louder both within Zimbabwe and from and and from the international community the spotlight remains family on Munangagwa's on Emerson Munangagwa and his administration whether those allegations will lead to concrete uh, investigation or reform remain un, uh, uncertain but they highlight the urgent need for effective governments and ethical leadership in Zimbabwe political landscape Sakandu zvo ndoma mirira zvakaita muri Zimbabwe mukati maino nyika ya Zimbabwe trikunzwa Jesus kuti ngorukuro yakaitwa kubva kuna former Zimbabwe information uh, minister professor Jonathan Moyo uh, yavakaita neanunzi ya Sofi Makoena anova mutauriri uh, we television ye nyika ya South Africa tukona kuti suso ipapo vakabudisa zvizere uh, about mbatore za NPF corruption yes ari kuitika mbatore za NPF achiti isusu uh, takagara sita zvona kudhara i corruption i ava mnanga ngo pamwe chete na vachiwenga muri kuziva here kuti chakaita kuti vabvise mugabe vaida iyo kusara vari pachigaro cha corruption endo zvakare vavopo example pativo a uh, mnanga ngo constitution chino chiwenga and sb moyo muno ziva here kuti uh, vakambo luta ma resources during pakaiti ka wondo ye ku drc vari kunzi vakatuma mauto avo e zimbabwe defense forces no ayen achino noba ama resources iko ku DRC vachivaigira saka ho corruption haina kutotanga nasi mbature za NPF wongu vanga sunge hawa ana wiki na chivayo wongu vanga de kuva indesa kuma interview akasena sana as corruption zvikunza haina kutanga nasi mbature za NPF dr kwa former Zimbabwean uh, information minister vanoe twa ivo professor Jonathan Moyo ndi zvakare u uh, sector kwa tambo ita kuti va makora afura vakambosanganona zvo zvakare vachinziwo uh, vari kuvana kutarisa na nezaki kufana yekuva indesa kumazitare zimwe famshure mekunge taka mbonzwa isi kuti ba uh, Jonathan Moyo uh, aishandisa Zimbabwe Main Power Development Fund for political uh, patronage in his home district Sholosho runde vakambobo zvakare Mario ye ZNPF izvo zvakamboita kuti vange vachimbobuda zvakare mukati maino nyika ya Zimbabwe saka tiona isi kuti ndo zvikuitika inside Zimbabwe vatariri ndozanziri na uzedi zvakare kichipiri guru msa 21 June Friday 2024 totenda kune mimi muri kufocus ane na uzedi za trukizo dzimwe na u toramba futi tichikupa ku rhyme awano tevera vatariri tichikuzivisa zvine chitika mukati menyika zuva nezuva kuita kuti musa poswe nema update yezvinenge chitika mukati menyika kana ngari first time yanyu mukanya mukana ndiwo uyu ngobaya paka nsubscribe and also mwe saka chikumwe kakanzi sharp kureva kuti matsigira page nori mawane ma chances yakuzanzwa zvakare dzimwe na udzenchika mukati mainonyika ngati bata nefuti mchikamchotera 3 tese